Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm partnering up with All Things Hair as part of their 100 years of holiday campaign. Now, 10 YouTubers have come together and we're all going to be recreating hairstyles inspired by classic looks from the past 10 decades. I'm gonna be doing a 60s hairstyle, so lots of volume, big curls, and it's very, very simple to achieve. You can check out allthingshair.com for more hair inspiration and all of the tutorials are gonna be there. So with that being said, let's jump right into the tutorial. All of these products can help you create any party look for this season. And you can even check out the other All Things Hair Ambassadors to see what look from what decade they've created. I'm going to be using a few of these products to create mine, so let's begin. I'll be using the Suave Coconut Oil Infusion Damage Repair Shampoo and Conditioner to start off. My hair is nice and clean now and the system repairs visible damage in just three uses. Now I'll be using the Nexus Hydra Leave-In Conditioning Foam. It's a daily leave-in treatment that further prevents flyaways and static while restoring softness and shine to the hair. I apply about two pumps of this leave-in conditioning foam to my damp hair and then just blow dry it. It softly shapes my hair, providing weightless hold and all day volume and conditioning. I'm going to start this look by using a rat tail comb to create a part on my left side. I'm going to also grab a section of hair to the left of the part and clip it out the way. I'll be working on this later. I'll be taking a teasing brush and start by back combing my hair gently to add fullness and volume. You can also just kind of scoop the back comb, kind of like in a C shape or like a scoop, and that will really help you create the volume that you desire. Now to smooth it down, you can just gently brush the top layer of hair to create the round shape. And now I'm going to let this section of hair down in which I will tease the opposite direction and then I'm going to brush it to smooth it out to its natural position. I'm also going to flat iron any other sections of hair that might be a little bit too wavy but I will make sure to keep the nice big bouncy curl on the ends. This really adds to the 60s look. Here I am grabbing the back section and pinning it in the back to secure with some bobby pins. Don't pull it too tight because you don't want to lose any volume. And the same goes for the front section of hair which will swoop across the corner of the forehead. I 
And last but not least, I'm going to add some Tresemme Tress 2 Extra Hold Hairspray to hold down any flyaways. You can just spray this about 10 to 12 inches away and you are done. Now you know that the holiday look is not complete without a little bling. So I like to use hair accessories during this time because they're really festive. So I'm just gonna add this gorgeous thin little headband to really just finish off the look. And that's it guys, this is the final 60s inspired holiday hair tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do have a chance to recreate this look, I would love to see it. So you can use the hashtag 100 years x holiday hair or hashtag all things hair so I can check them out. And if you are interested, you can also check out allthingshair.com for all of the other looks that the other girls recreated from the other decades. I can't wait to see what they have done. I'm really, really excited and I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So thanks for watching, have a fabulous, an amazing day and I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye!